We had to create another tour in, in Germany and Poland because there's just simply so much history. You know, this is really where uh, the Second World War, when it comes to Hitler and the battle with the East, really takes place. And so with uh, the Megastructures tour, we were focusing on a slightly different angle from the rise and fall of Hitler's Germany, which is to look at the consequences for the people who actually were enslaved under this regime. We look at things like uh, the creation, these massive bunkers, uh, um, Hitler's prora, this, this massive, huge concrete um, sort of hotel that he built for, for his workers. But he also, um, we also look at Pinamunda and the importance of the V1 and V2 rocket program and the whole history of Werner von Braun, who of course later comes to head NASA in the United States, throwing up all sorts of moral questions about what did you do with the Third Reich after it had fallen apart. But of course Werner von Braun knew about the massive slave laborers that were um, used in places like Nordhausen to build these rockets. And so it's a very complex, interesting tour which looks at a different aspect of Hitler's Germany. We return to Warsaw, so for those people who've been on the Rise and Fall tour already, we do have a different program for Warsaw. We're going to places like Paviak Prison, which was the notorious Gestapo and SS prison in the center of Warsaw. We're also going to go to Treblinka, which in my view was really the most deadly of all the extermination camps, where over 850,000 human beings lost their lives. And it's an incredibly sobering and tragic place, but it's also a very important place to visit. And again, we end up with a dinner uh, at my manor house just outside of Warsaw to celebrate uh, what we, this journey that we've all been on together.